go. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Meet the Dog. I'm Chris, this is Aniela, and with us today is Waverly. Waverly is from the Christmas litter, born back in Christmas 2021. Her parents are, what are you doing? Uh, her parents are Trip and Capri, who are also the parents of the Poppins litter, currently over in ICE. Um, she eats twice a day. Uh, right now she's on two cups each. Um, though hopefully we can bump her back up to three soon. Uh, she is probably around, I want to say 110, maybe around one, getting into 120. Um, she is doing pretty well in her training. I actually, I do have some footnotes here, uh, that one of our trainers had, uh, made up for me. Uh, thank you, John, for making this up for me. Uh, she went to Bentley Warren today, uh, and she did well watching the sand and gravel trucks drive on and off the scale. Uh, though she did have a bit of trouble loading and unloading from the car. Uh, they have That is something that they have been working on her with recently. Um, she has been a bit, uh, I guess, antsy about getting in and out of cars. Um, but it sounds like she did a lot better today. Uh, her pace is doing great. Uh, she still has a bit of head swivel uh, when watching people in public, but her it sounds like her confidence is improving. So it seems like she's doing she's doing uh, pretty well in training. Uh, so we got some hopes for her. Um, let's see. What else about Wavy? Uh, I used to when she was a lot younger. We used to tell her apart from the other. She has this big white stripe that goes all the way back. Um, onto her neck. Uh, I think we got another one in the Poppins litter who's got something like that. I think, I think it's uh, Pearly who's got that. Though Pearly's is a lot wider, I think, all the way back, where hers kind of like thins at like the nape of the neck. Um, yeah, so she's a very good girl. Uh, we all love her very much. Uh, and I will open it to any questions about Miss Waverly. questions and I'll try to think of anything in the meantime. Um you guys start Waverly stories lately? Well, I guess you haven't done anything that crazy lately, huh? You've been pretty chill lately. You haven't given, been giving us a run for our money. She she has very, like, she has those, like, droopy red eyes, but she looks, whenever she looks up and, like, they kind of, like, go down a little bit, she looks so much like her sister, Bessie. Uh, <laughs> she really does. Uh, she's got a lot longer, fa her face is a lot more narrow, but, like, the, when she looks up, they absolutely have the same eyes. Um, it's, it's... Yeah. For me, it was that stripe because Bessie's ends like right between the eyes or like a little above it when Waverly's just goes all the way back. <laughs> now, hang on. Jack. Jack. Yeah, Jack's head is huge. Uh, Jack, Jack and Wallace, their heads are, are huge. Um, <laughs> can't fill apart from Jack. Uh, Barb VS, what makes Waverly happy? Uh, I, I would say getting out and running around. She, she, like the rest of her siblings, very energetic, rambunctious dog. She loves to run and run and run and run and run. Uh, so she loves it when she gets out onto, like, Flatfield or uh, Puppy Hill. She loves getting to the pond, anywhere where she can just go. Um, she loves playing with her brothers. Uh, oh, Crafty asks what favorite, pl speaking of which, uh, Crafty asks favorite playmates and food. Uh, food, whatever we give her. Um... <laughs> No, 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 hold on. I got dictionary.com on my phone. We'll just look, we'll just check for that. Uh, <laughs> uh, so I would say friendly, rambunctious.
good word. Yeah, what's your third word? You're giving us some trouble here. What, what, is, a, what is a good third word? Actually, you know what? Someone just asked a question. That is a great word for the whole uh, troublemaker kind of mischievous. mischievous. Okay, yes. so friendly, rambunctious, mischievous. Uh, and thank you, Barbie, for asking, does she ever get into any mischief? Which, yeah, nothing too serious. Um, she's a bit of a digger. Uh, if we let her out here, she'll do a little bit of digging. Uh, and she can be a bit of a barker at times. Uh, but thankfully, she, is, she didn't get in, in, into anything too crazy too often. Cammy uh, uh, asked, does Waverly have a favorite training location? I'm actually not, you know, I don't know. Uh, I would probably say anywhere that doesn't have traffic, because that's that's a huge thing that our dogs hate is traffic. So I think anywhere that's quiet, she'll probably enjoy. Oh, the camera went to highlights while I was answering questions on what she likes. Uh, so, for that one, I think that was the favorite Playmates and Food question, uh, which was, food was for any, pretty much anything, um, she'll eat pretty much anything, and then her favorite Playmates were Fred, Davis, Jack, pretty much anyone that can keep up with her. Um... Hopefully we hopefully we didn't lose too much from it going to highlights. Uh, maybe the internet spiked a little bit there. Uh, hi, yes, hello, hi, hello. You look so much like your sister when you look up. You know that? You really do. Why did I just lock my phone? I need still need my phone open. All right. Any questions about uh, Waverly? Any more questions about Miss Waverly? Honestly, I think Bessie looks a bit more like Capri. Though Bessie, Bessie really looks like her grandma Sizzle. Like out of all, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, she, she, she looks the most, out of all of them, she looks a lot like Sizzle. Um, but I think Capri's, uh, Capri, Waverly's got the right markings for it, but Bessie has the face. Bessie's face is a lot closer. Waverly's is just a little bit too long. So hers is like long and narrow. Um, which I'm wondering if she maybe gets that from Tripp's side of the family. Though Tripp doesn't have a very like na long, narrow face. He looks a lot more like Emma. Yeah. He's kind of got that. Dro he's got that. Yeah, that droopy face, where they always look sad, like Emma, a a like Emma and Evie, who always look sad, like at any given time. And it's so, like, it psychs me out because I never know what they're feeling. <laughs> um, I want to refresh real quick because uh, I think the internet might spike and I might have missed a couple questions so I'm going to refresh the page real quick let's see if I missed anything oh here's one I need this, uh, what, for, this is for both of us what do we love the most about Waverly okay I'll give you a second to think I love just how cuddly she is. Uh, her and all her sisters will do this. Uh, when you go into their kennels with them, when you, especially when you give them fluffies, they will chill in the loft with you and they will flop down next to you and they want lovings. Um, they will they will just like lie down for the belly rubs. They will be all over you. They're just real, they love the attention. They're just such adorable loving girls. Um, while, you know what, I say that Wallace does it too. Wallace does that a lot too. Uh, Jack and Davis, a little bit, not as much, but Waverly, the yeah. sister. Yeah, Jack, not as much, but definitely still, yeah. Uh, what about you? What do you love about Waverly? Crafty says her sister Mandy came to the farm last night. Did you see her? I did not. Um, I, I was told about that this morning, actually. I saw Sharon this morning, but Mandy was already gone. 
Uh, and as far as I know, I don't I don't think they came in to see any of their siblings, because I imagine that probably would have caused an uproar in the barn. Um, uh, I didn't see her, and I don't think, because you, you weren't here yesterday, were you? No. Yeah, you know what? I was here yesterday. I would know that. Um, <laughs> uh, so, unfortunately, no, I, I did not get to see Mandy. Um, she, she was gone when I got here. Uh, Crafty also says, interesting about the check line, droopy face. Yeah, yeah, Emma, Evie, and Trip all have it. I don't know. I don't know any other dogs from that line, so, like, I don't know anything for reference. But, yeah, all three of them, those three have very droopy faces. <laughs> they are, they, their kind of default face is they look sad. <laughs> and it can be very, like, it, it, it kind of can psych you out at times because you're like, are you, are you okay? Do, do I need to do something? What, uh, Barb V asks, what would Waverly like to say to you right now? Um, hmm. Well, you don't seem like antsy to go back into your kennel, so I don't think it's you want to go take a nap. Uh, I think it's probably, can you get one of my brothers out here so I can actually, like, run around and have some fun? Um, is that it, or are you just tired and you want to go back into your kennel? You do seem a little out of it, so you know what? It might just be that. <laughs> Good girl. All right, I'm going to give it another minute for any last-minute questions about Miss Waverly, and then we're going to wrap up for today. Any last-minute questions about Miss Waverly? Hello, yes. Question mark. Uh, we'll cross deep, but not boogie. All right, so that is all the time we have. Thank you all very much for tuning in. We will be back uh, next week with another dog. Until then, everybody have a good night.